What is that, Susan? Um, this is the door to the gas chamber. Ooh. So this is actually from like an old submarine. This is what they would use, these mm -hmm. type of doors, mm -hmm. because they would seal really well around the edges. Mm. Yeah, we do keep it locked because we try to keep people off the bed in there. You know, it is a museum. Now, this area over here, this is where they would give the dosage of the lethal injection. They had these holes, and you would have tubes going in, mm -hmm. and they would have some type of a area here where they would have switches and you'd have like three COs in here and they'd all hit the switch and nobody knew who had the switch of death. If you look up here, this is fresh air. And that fresh air, that was gas. That was fresh air. When this was a gas chamber, they would turn that on and gas would start in there. After the execution, they would do this and the gas would come out. This almost caused killed a CO who was posted over here. So mm. that's kind of why they got rid of the gas chamber as well. Now, Cammie and I were here last night and she left her recording going and we're hearing this. We didn't know where it was coming from. So she played the video and she's walking around, she's hitting everything and she goes, that's it, that's it. So we were actually interacting with spirits in the death chamber and they were clinging over here. Mm -hmm. sure.